Hi, this is Karthik. I warmly welcome you all for this session. In this session, I'm going to teach you how to configure Gmail using IMAP with Microsoft Outlook 2010. Once again, I repeat the topic: how to configure Gmail using IMAP with Microsoft Outlook 2010. You may ask a question: What is IMAP? IMAP stands for Internet Message Access Protocol. Once again, what is IMAP? I stands for Internet, M stands for Message, A stands for Access, and P stands for Protocol. So we are going to configure Gmail by using the protocol IMAP with Microsoft Outlook 2010. In order to achieve this task, we should open Microsoft Outlook 2010. How to open Microsoft Outlook 2010? It's quite simple. Go to Start, go to All Programs, and go to Microsoft Office and navigate to Microsoft Outlook 2010. Once again, I repeat the steps. Go to Start, go to All Programs and go to Microsoft Office and navigate to Microsoft Outlook 2010. Click Microsoft Outlook 2010 in order to open it. So whenever you click on Microsoft Outlook 2010, it will take you to the environment where you can able to manage your mails. So now this environment is already configured with some other email. So now I wish to add a new account. How to add a new account? Go to File and click on Add Accounts. Once again, I repeat the steps. In order to create a new account, click Files and click Add Accounts. When you click on Add Accounts, it will generate Add New Window. That is a Add New Account Window where you want to select the option manually configure server setting or additional server type once again i repeat the process so when you click on add account it will generate add new account window you want to select the option manually configure server settings or additional server types and click next in order to proceed when you click on next add new account window will be generated and by default internet email option will be selected where this option contains connect to pop or imap server to send and receive email messages just click next so now provide the information before that when you click on next add new account window will be generated or popped up where it contains three types of information so internet email settings under this where you can able to find user information server information Logon information. So provide your username, let us say Kartwick, and your email address. So after in server information, now I, I'm going to use IMAP Internet Message Access Protocol. So the outgoing mail server will be IMAP dot gmail.com and outgoing mail server smtp is smtp.gmail.com and provide the username and password the password will be the password of your gmail after completing all the required information navigate to more setting okay once again i repeat the steps after providing all the information such as user information, server information and logon information, then navigate or click on more settings. When you click on more settings, the internet email setting window will be popped up and then navigate to outgoing server. You just click on outgoing server and click my outgoing server SMTP request authentication after completing the task navigate to advanced tab and now you want to give the incoming server imap is 993 you want to use the port 993 and encryption type ssl and here you want to use ssl and smtp 
either you can use 4 6 5 or else you can use 5 8 7 okay so again I repeat these steps when you click on more settings the internet email setting window will be popped up and then just click on outgoing server and click check the option my out, outgoing server SMTP request authentication and then navigate to advanced tab and provide the port number 993 for incoming server IMAP and provide the port number 587 for outgoing server and enable SSL and click OK so I'm going to uncheck this option because I don't have internet so click next in order to finish it and click for finish now the new account has been added so this is how you want to use Gmail along with Microsoft Outlook 2010 by using the protocol IMAP I think you guys have enjoyed this video thanks for watching this video